Hey y'all. Um, I got a little mini rant. Mini rant for y'all today. So, for those of you who don't know, I was a cashier, a manager of some sorts at a grocery store. So I have grocery store experience people. Um, my rant today is going out to all the baggers across America. Um, and it's basically what not to do so that you don't piss off your customers. And believe me, I know how to bag. And I work my hardest to get all the foods in the correct categories, like all the fruits and vegetables together, all the cold stuff together to make your job easier. But you today, sir, have made my life harder. So here, here are my groceries for this week. And this, this is what bugs me. Here, let's see. We've got one item in this bag. Let's find another one of those. This has three items, could have easily held this stuff into one bag. This has one item in the bag. One item in the bag. Also, this is almond milk. This is creamer. This meat has is just one item in the bag. Let's see. Again, more meat that could have been with other meat people. You might need to tell your manager you need better lessons on bagging. Because that is super frustrating to grab so many single item bags. Just, I'm the kind of person, and the thing is, I don't usually use plastic bags. I use the reusable bags, but today, I was totally out of it. I don't know if you can tell right now. I'm totally out of it. I'm tired. New workout that I did today. And, uh, yeah. Okay, so yesterday, yesterday I bought um, some new K cups and I'm kind of really excited to try them. They are <gasps> vanilla cream puff. I mean, doesn't that just sound delicious? So I'm going to do a taste test for my vlog. creamer and two teaspoons of sugar so it should be just perfect. It doesn't taste like anything. <laughs> what doesn't? It doesn't taste like a vanilla cream puff. That's why I don't like all flavored coffee. Like the vanilla biscotti is good, hazelnut is good. This, unfortunately, does not taste like anything. So don't buy it if you're expecting it to taste like a vanilla cream puff. <laughs>
at the beginning of the vlog, me trying out that, what was it? Let me see. It was the vanilla cream puff. And I basically thought it was not anywhere close to what it said. Huge disappointment. So today we are trying the Nutty Hazelnut. I feel like this is a pretty safe one. Hazelnut's pretty hard to mess up. This might be like a new thing weekly, like coffee segments with K-cups. I mean, I'm not drinking. Why? Okay. I, I don't like using K-cups just because I feel like it's a waste of plastic, but at the same time, they're convenient and they do taste good. So I've been using them because I don't drink as much coffee as I used to. So today, this week, we are trying the Nutty Hazelnut. Okay, I'll change it in a second the nutty hazelnut and if this doesn't taste good either then donut shop is not a good brand i'm gonna go check on clivey Kind of hard to mess up hazelnut. I mean, it's really easy. Whoa. Oh my goodness. Maybe I shouldn't have put sugar in it. Sugar in what? Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm gonna try round two of this. Okay, people. It says sweet and creamy. No milk or sugar needed. Okay, here is round two. I've got my coffee. I did not put anything in it. So this this time around, it should taste better. Hoping, ugh. Can anybody not cross their fingers? I can't do it. All right, here we go. It's a bit hot. Tiny sips. Ugh, this is gross. I don't know if it's because I've really significantly changed my sugar intake, but don't get it. Disappointment number two, the donut shop. 